Hey, Eric. We haven't spoken to you in a while. How's your health? Good. Can you ever just call me Eric the actor? Eric the actor. All right. In honor of your phone call, call uh, you. Yes, because we've missed you. Mm. Thank you. But um, I'm going back to Eric the Midget tomorrow. Shortly. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> but today you're Eric the actor. All right, Eric the actor. What can I do for you? You're talking about the fact of Beth being in Vegas. Yes. Last week I was in Vegas with my parents, and I went to the Chris Angel show, and she was in the audience. Yes, she was invited by Chris Angel to be in the audience. And then Chris Angel did the thing that Beth dreads the most. He he introduced oh, her. Oh, oh he, 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 just, he, he didn't put her in a trick, did he? he no, no, no. <laughs> no he, actually, he actually said something nice. He said, hey, you know, Howard Stern uh, helped my, my career early on, had me on the show. I'll never forget that. And his wife is in the audience. And it was actually very nice of him. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, he did that at the end of the show. At the start of the show, he did a trick where he ended up in the audience and he ran right past where I was sitting and he, you know, gave five to myself and my dad that was sitting next to me. Yeah, that's because oh. you got the wheelchair thing going on. Are you right up front? No, we were behind the front section. You got to high five the kid in the wheelchair. Of course. That's the way it goes. You can't run past a wheelchair without acknowledging <laughs> Yeah, I mean, like, you know, it's like when I used to do my book signings, <laughs> there'd always be like one or two guys in a wheelchair, and everything has to stop because... That's right. They get extra special attention. Because if you're a shithead to a wheelchair guy, <laughs> you, you know, that's it. You're going to burn in hell. That's a headline. Yeah, as, it, as anyone who's in show business would know, and I'm barely in it, but I, I know enough that when the, the wheelchair guy would come to the book signing, everything would say, Howard, this is uh, so and so and he needs to take a picture with you yeah. and if, he, if the guy if you're needs... on two legs keep it moving <laughs> yeah oh yeah if you're two legs fuck you it's like with the guy in a wheelchair so chris angel of course high fives eric but uh yeah and he actually um uh, was really nice and bought beth didn't like paid for their dinner uh -huh. somehow i don't know how he got that all done but he did he, he was a nice he was nice enough to uh, treat her special yeah, afterwards when we were out in the casino floor i was trying to look to see if i could he best to go up to her and say hi to her, but I didn't see her anywhere. Nah, she probably went. She, I think she went home after the show, she told me. She doesn't gamble, does she? No. See, that's not her thing. That's not her thing. So that was the end. What of else that. did you do in Vegas? Well, I just checked out the different hotels, and you know, I played the slot machines a little bit. Did you win? Yeah. See, Eric's a winner. There you go. There you go. But, uh... By, by the way, Joni's on one of the other lines, and he fell asleep on you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Johnny's asleep? Yeah. Let me see that. Johnny. Hey, I'm here. Oh. Oh. Are you woke up? He's not talking to you, Eric. He's pretending to sleep <laughs> on you. you mean, Johnny, when Eric's on the line, you pretend to sleep? <laughs> <laughs> It does cut down on having to talk with him. He's mad, he's mad at me right now, Howard, because he wants to be my manager. Oh, come on. Stop it. He, he, I, he does. He actually wants That's to be my silly. manager. And I gave him some, some outrageous things that I thought I deserved. Things like what he... Because he's got me booked at strip clubs, Howard. Yeah. yeah he's working for you. It's all, sir. It's all silly. It's silly. I don't want to go. I, don't, I told him I don't want to go to strip clubs. <laughs> it's silly you know? stuff. He wants hey, to go Howard, to strip club. Yeah. Did you notice? Did anybody tell you that we all, a bunch of the people from your show, got in Time Magazine? No. In the current, the very current issue of Time Magazine, uh, there's an article about Neil Strauss, and in the article it mentions myself and Anthony Baza and Amber Smith. All right. All right, Johnny, thank you. And Eric, thank you. I'm glad you saw my wife in Vegas. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. See, see Howard, you could have had him like a, a double agent or something following yeah. her. All right, thanks, guys. Hey, Howard, one more thing. What are, you, are you ever going to play any of those things? Yeah, what thing? I will. Johnny did oh, some his interviews. interviews. I'll yeah. get to those today. We will? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm going to get to it. I love it. All I right. love it. Thank you, Johnny. Okay. Right. okay. Thank you, Eric. Eric, the uh, actor for the day. Good to hear Eric. He sounds good. I was worried about yep. him. Eric, Eric. All right, Eric, thank you. Thank you for taking my call. Yep. Eric, Eric. All right.
Glad to know he's okay. Fascinating story how Eric saw my wife in Vegas. Well, I was hung on every word. <laughs> that was a pretty good story, huh? The kid can light up the was, phone. I was in the same room. Oh, my God. It was <laughs> unbelievable. And I, I got high five. <sighs> can't believe Chris Angel. Which was more exciting to you, the part where he got high five by Chris Angel or he saw Beth in the audience and she stood up? Jeez, I, it's hard to choose between the two. My favorite part was when he told us Johnny was sleeping, and then it turned out Johnny was awake. <laughs> and then when Johnny told us about Time Magazine. Well, that, that was, was a showstopper. Yeah. So which part do you like the best one? Johnny, I'll make it like the wrap-up right. show. Johnny's story about Time Magazine. I think that was my favorite part. That was your favorite yeah, part? Yeah, that was my favorite part. Did you know any of the people Johnny was mentioning? Heck no. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know how that's getting us mentioned in Time Magazine. I don't know. <laughs> and that's why I'm fascinated with that part. We'll have to get the issue. Do you think I hung up too fast? Do you think I should, should have continued with that story? I think you hung up too slow. <laughs> too slow. I tried to hang up faster. <laughs> All right. Okay, thank you for your call. All right. Anybody wishing we were on vacation <laughs> after that phone call?